The chairperson of the Village Development Committee says the foundation of an NBC tower has been laid, but the construction is still to be done. Brian Kalonda says the situation is depriving residents of the island from information and that they feel left out from the Namibian house. Here we don't watch TV. Even for radio reception, you have to climb trees to mount your aerial so that you can listen to NBC radio. When you put it down, you can't hear a word. They came here 10 years ago to put a tower that side, but it's now a white elephant with just the foundation around. We are aware materials and equipment were there, but now it has been taken elsewhere. Those who travel are seeing the equipment in other regions written in Palila. The materials left by the contractor given to construct the tower are now covered by shrubs and bushes, while some facing materials have grown into trees without care and security. Our demands have been put in writing through the office of the councillor and we believe it has reached the ministers. We said we need our materials and the contractor they gave to contract the tower must be held accountable and he should tell where the materials were taken. We want the equipment to be brought here at Impalila and construct our tower. The VDC chairperson further raised concern with the situation of the MTC tower adjacent to a plot given to NBC which does not have a light, putting aeroplanes flying to the island at risk, especially at night. Contacted for comment, NBC Chief Technology Officer Tuliki Shipanga reiterated that NBC is aware of the Impalila Tower situation. Shipanga, however, stressed that the Digital Terrestrial Television Project DDT Link was a government project and that government stopped funding the project. Hence, the situation is still as it is. MTC technician in the Zambez region, Elvis Mushwena, said they will attend to the non-functioning light at the Impalila Tower. Sililombiana, NBC News, Impalila Island.